Well, did you miss them? Water restrictions. No more excessive watering. Turn off the faucet while you're brushing your teeth. What going forward, rain or shine, is a waste of water. The familiar rules may become reality in the state as water officials once again grapple with signs of a new drought. So with such a dry winter, what's in our future? CBS 13's Lamore Abrams is at the California Environmental Protection Agency where officials are back at it. When I see people with green lawns and then the water running down the sidewalk and then a block down the gutter, it's obviously a waste. To avoid being that person, Corbay Anderson let her lawn go a couple years ago when the state first imposed drought regulations. I'm the brown lawn in the midst of sea of green. But more Californians may soon find her approach to conservation to be the new normal. What going forward, rain or shine, is a waste of water. Water wasters. That's who Water Resources Board Chair Felicia Marcus says she plans to target as her agency considers whether to reinstate those temporary water bans put in place during California's historic four-year drought. Are we back in a drought? There are some areas of the state that may well be technically in a, in a, a drought in terms of their precipitation, but they get their water from different places. They may have groundwater, they may have recycled water, they may have imported water. But the whole state becomes in a state of drought. And if the Water Control Board has its way, the whole state, regardless of who has more rain, will be under permanent water restrictions. They may sound familiar. No more watering outside 48 hours after it rains. No more using a hose to wash sidewalks. Even some water fountains may be banned. Rules that may be enforced with a $500 fine. That's yeah, it. we don't want it long. If you're not already doing so, state water officials suggest you start saving every drop. And the water board will come back to the table for a vote next month, and the new rules may go into effect as early as April. Well, new water restrictions are coming to the capital city starting March 1st. You'll only be able to allow to water two days per week. The restrictions will run through October 31st. But if temperatures reach more than 100 degrees for two or more days, you will not be able to water.